Radiographer Paul Martin was told wrongly he had type 2 diabetes. He's one of many diabetic patients to be diagnosed with the incorrect version of the disease, both of which take very different forms. So they put me on um, tablets, so metformin and glycoside, and then I was able to um, just ta continue taking those for, for months until I saw a consultant uh, who then uh, said that I, my diabetes had got worse and was at, I was, so I was actually diagnosed as type 1 then. Now his condition has stabilised thanks to regular insulin injections. For others, misdiagnosis can lead to severe health complications, even death. Type 1 diabetes is mostly diagnosed in the young and requires daily injections, while type 2 is strongly linked to obesity and can sometimes be controlled through improved diet and weight loss. Current diagnosis is based mostly on a patient's age and weight. A British doctor wants to change that. He's developed a genetic test which he says is cheap and fast. If someone could have a blood sample taken, it'd be sent to our lab here and have the genetic risk score tested. What we think is better for people with diabetes both in the UK and around the rest of the world is if their local hospital could do this test on a benchside machine. Those judged to have either diabetes type would undergo more extensive tests to confirm diagnosis. Leading research charity Diabetes UK welcomes the research. They're looking at making it a very cheap process so that people can literally have a phone app that will help them determine whether it's type 1 or type 2. And it will be cheap enough that you can do it universally. So one of the problems that with, with lots of the research is that things cost a lot of money. This is, it's really great because it's, it identifies what the risks of type 1 and type 2 are and means that you're much more likely to get the right diagnosis quickly. Our age of growing obesity is making diabetes diagnosis more difficult than ever for doctors. But developers of this test think it will be a huge help, saving time and money and improving health outcomes for patients.